In this tutorial, we learn simple thresholding, adaptive thresholding, Otsu's thresholding. We will learn these functions, CV threshold, CV adaptive threshold. We can use image threshold method to make license plate recognition or Sudoku recognition. As you can see in method first argument is the source image, which should be a grayscale image. Second argument is the threshold value which is used to classify the pixel values. Third argument is the max val which represents the value to be given if pixel value is more than, sometimes less than, the threshold value. In adaptive thresholding, the algorithm calculate the threshold for a small regions of the image. So we get different thresholds for different regions of the same image and it gives us better results for images with varying illumination. In global thresholding, we used an arbitrary value for threshold value. So, how can we know a value we selected is good or not? Answer is, trial and error method. But consider a bimodal image, in simple words, bimodal image is an image whose histogram has two peaks. For that image, we can approximately take a value in the middle of those peaks as threshold value. That is what Otsu binarization does. So in simple words, it automatically calculates a threshold value from image histogram for a bimodal image. Go to the code to check detail how method working. Let's check the Otsu threshold method. As you can see, after use blur and Otsu threshold method noise filter is much more better. Source code you can download under video description. Thanks for your watching. Like and subscribe to follow channel.